Welcome back, everybody. It is 655. Kevin O'Neill celebrating Western New York. What are you wearing, my friend? I like the look, baby. I've had this leisure suit on for 10 minutes. I'm already surrounded by six women. Hello, ladies. How are you? <laughs> nice to see you. Good morning. Four women in historic hats. We didn't want to go to the full costume, and that's okay. We respect that. And we're here with uh, Georgia. How are you? Nice to see Hi you. Hi there. For, tell me about your outfit. My outfit is an 1818 Regency style with mm -hmm. poke bonnet, mm -hmm. and it would be traditional what they would have worn in 1818. And what is Miranda wearing? And Miranda is wearing a doubling dress. Okay. And a doubling dress was the uh, old-fashioned pregnancy dress. So it's got a little extra fabric had, on the side. And it had darts that would be released mm. as she doubled. The Shelby's Bicentennial is this weekend. What a great day for the town. Tell me about the fashion show this weekend. The fashion show is at 2 o'clock at Oak Orchard Elementary School. Mm -hmm. And we will have fashions from 1818 to 2018 with historical tidbits thrown in. Wow, fantastic. There is a fashion show. There are tours of Shelby. The Village of Medina is, is partially in Shelby. So we're all Medina friends here, right? Oh, Absolutely right. great. So uh, so uh, you could uh, tour the areas of Shelby with the driving tours. There is a slideshow as well. For more information, townofshelbyny.org. Cousin Eddie from uh, Vacation comes to mind. It's a good look, Kev. I'd Thanks, keep it Clark. going. <laughs> That that's a that's an outfit that takes you back to that that yeah, movie sure in his RV parked out front. Absolutely. <laughs> you guys do have those somewhere in your closet somewhere. The leisure suit. Mm -hmm. I've got a, a a velour suit that sometimes makes an appearance in a corduroy. Oh. Yeah. It's... Notice the surprise on my face. <laughs> yeah, it's like we stands to reason. Very good. Bye everyone. We'll see you back here tomorrow. See ya.